Okay, so just finishing up. Um, I have a lot more stuff to go through, but I'm going to go through it really quick. Um, so at Jean Malin, they teach you how to do, um, you know, hair mostly. Um, they also teach you how to do makeup, and we're also going to learn some stuff about nails, as well as like, um, like facials and waxing and all that kind of stuff too. So um, in one of my bags here, I have tweezers. Um, I have um, I have a pair of shears. Well, I have two pairs of shears. Actually, no, I'm lying. I have like several pairs of shears, but I have to use uh, these specific ones for when we actually work on clients. And then I have then I have these pair of shears where these are specifically only for the mannequins. Um, I mean, I don't really know why we have to use two different ones, but um. I guess they just don't want like the blades to dull or they just, you know, want to keep things separated or whatever, which is fine. Um, what else do I have? I have a razor, which I'm kind of excited to use, which uh, I'm also kind of scared because I've never had to use a razor on like anything before, except like cleaning stuff. <laughs> so when it comes to somebody's head, it's like, that's a little nerve wracking, but I'm pretty sure they'll teach us how to do everything. So I'm not too worried about it. Um... Oh, and I have brushes for days. Like, I don't know why I have so many brushes and combs. It's like, I thought we only needed, like, three. No, I have, like, seven. <laughs> but I have, like, three, um, what do you call these? Round brushes. Um, there's a smaller one here. Um, you have your medium-sized one. And then you have your large one here. Um, I have my, uh my cushioned uh, bristle brush which um honestly like like I said before I only really use these to you know just just make sure like my hair is smooth but like I really rather use like the other kind of brush for like weave and stuff because it's just a lot less harsh and, and you don't have to like you know scratch your scalp and all that other stuff and you remember when I just said I had all these combs right so I really have all these combs like I have they call this <laughs> The pin tail comb but in the hood it's called a rat tail comb but I'ma just let them call it a pin tail comb because I just think that's funny um there's the shampoo comb um kind of looks like a comb from like Conair or whatever but um yeah shampoo comb I expected the um the teeth on the comb to be a little bit more spaced out but um they're actually kind of close together or whatever and um these are all products from um diane it, that's what most of these products are called like on my paper they were supposed to be something else but they're all called diane products um there's a wide tooth comb here uh a cutting comb for when you start cutting clients hair a basin comb and a, another cutting comb because I'm pretty sure you have those little clips of people that, you know, will actually be the one to cut off a tooth on the comb and I got to get another one. So I'm actually glad that they gave us like multiple combs. Um, I have my hairstyling cape, which, you know, you got to put over your customers when you cut their hair so you don't get hair all up in your clothes and stuff. And then I have my apron, which I'm really excited about, which they really pressed us to wear because we're going to be, you know, doing... You know coloring and dyeing people's hair and stuff like that and we don't want to get on our you know black clothes so we got to make sure we wear our apron um oh i have some more um i got some nail stuff in here um there's some manicure sticks which my dumb ass thought they were chopsticks and i'm like what are we eating i don't know but yeah they're they're manicure <laughs> sticks <laughs> um this is a cuticle pusher you know, like when you get your nails done and they, you know, just push your cuticles back, which I need to do. I don't know why I didn't do them yesterday on my nails, but yeah, there's the cuticle pusher. Um, another thing I have for days are hair clips. I don't know how many hair clips I have in total. Like, these are literally gator clips, large butterfly clips. 
more gator clips. Oh, and um, here's a manicure brush for, you know, more nail stuff. I'm sorry if I don't, like, have everything, like, grouped in order here. It's just because of how I put it all back in my bag because I was in a rush and there was too much shit. But here's some, um, like, some ponytail um, hair ties or whatever. They're really thin. I'm probably going to end up getting more because I'm probably going to end up using some of these my damn self because I always write out hair ties and I like hair ties a lot, especially the thin ones. Um, another th thing I have a lot of is a lot of, um, emery boards. Um, I have, how many come in a pack? Five, ten, I have like 15 of these things. Probably gonna end up keeping one for myself. Um, what else do I have here? Oh yeah, my, um, my dye bowl for, you know, when we have to dye people's hair. It is clear, looks like a little measuring cup. Sorry if you can't see that too well. My bowl. Um, oh yeah, um, this is the um, soft finger diffuser for my blow dryer. Cause like I never use this when I get blow dryers. Like I don't even know how to use it, but they will teach me. So when I figure it out, I'll let you know in case somebody else don't know how to use it. Um, and more hair clips. But these ones are metal, and I get two packs of these. So those are the metal ones here. Um, I have oh my my dyeing brush here. Kind of reminds me of the brush where you you know glaze barbecue sauce on the chicken. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, we you know we gotta use this for your hair, so <laughs> that's what we're gonna be using that for. And I have three pairs of gloves. They're all medium size, but I believe one is different. Um, we're supposed to use, um, I think the blue, like there's there's blue gloves and there's like a pack of black gloves. And we use the, uh, the blue gloves for when we're in class. And then we use the black gloves for when we have our clients and they don't want us like mixing up the two. Because, like, I guess that's how the teachers can just, like, tell, like, where you're at or whatever. So if you use the wrong gloves, they're going to get on you about that. So, yeah, it's three pairs of latex gloves that I have. Um, what else? Oh, and they gave me an iPad. Um, it's the iPad Mini. But, um, I think they pretty much, like, um, like, censor the iPad like they do with, like, most you know, public schools that use computers, it's like you can't really, like, well, I mean, don't tell nobody, but I checked it today, I can go on Facebook, I don't know why they said that I couldn't, but I can, but, um, usually, like, if something is, like, restricted on here, obviously you can't use it, like, any other, like, you know, school with computers or whatever, because they just want us to focus on what we're supposed to do, so, yeah, I got the iPad mini, which we do not get to keep, and I thought we did get to keep them, but I really don't care because I don't like Apple products anyway, or I just don't really care for iPads. I have another tablet. It's not that big a deal. Um, and I got my bag. Actually, let me bring this over. I got a um, machine Madeline bag, which I have to squish all my stuff into every day. Um, but it comes with, um, you know, little rollers on the bottom, it comes with like little handles so I don't have to kill myself trying to pull all my stuff around. And, um, that's, that's pretty much all of my stuff that I got for my kit. And I'm really happy to get to use all my things and I can't wait to like work on all my clients and stuff. So, um, if anybody has any questions about anything, just, you know, don't hesitate to ask and I will let you know. Bye.